Hello, land investors and outdoor enthusiasts. This is Josh from US Recland. Uh, we're bringing you another property here. Uh, but as always, please subscribe to our website, usrecland.com. Uh, that way you'll receive emails for exclusive deals. We won't blow up your email, just two or three a month. Uh, that way you'll be abreast of any discounts or uh, bundle packages, waived fees, any uh, flash sales we have going on for your favorite land. And also please subscribe to the YouTube channel and click the notification bell so you'll be the first to know about new video listings just like this one. All right, let's take a look here, Jackson County, Florida. And we're asking 949 on this one, 9,500 bucks. And it's 1.07 acres and it's located in Jackson County, Florida. This is actually in the city of Alford. Uh, to give you an idea, here is your parcel number. For those of you that want to uh, purchase the property and need to perform a little due diligence, contact the county, refer to that parcel ID number, uh, and we recommend that you do. Kind of lay out your vision for the property and uh, let them know what you want to do. And uh, here are your X, Y. This is your Google Maps, Google Earth satellite coordinates. We highly recommend utilize this to give yourself a virtual review of the location and the surrounding area, uh, which might help you make a better decision on if the property is right for you. And this particular property, this is zoned residential. So yes to modular and site built homes, as long as they're a thousand square foot, no mobile homes, no RVs, uh, anything beyond that, please contact Jackson County as usual. No flood zones, no wetlands, tax is 45 bucks, uh, not breaking the bank here. But let's look at a couple photos. Here's the front. So nice, nice little wooded lot. So you got the peace and quiet of the rural, rural area. Here's the lot with front and road access. All right. And here you can see it's subdivided, flatted out. Again, we always buy properties that have multiple exit strategies. And this Jackson market is white hot. Uh, the, all of the other Jackson properties we had flew off the shelf. So uh, if you're just looking even just for investor lots, these are good lots, but obviously there's some homes in the area. Uh, so some other folks are living the rural country life. So that's not a bad idea either, right? All right, there's the location. And there's the parcel here on Arapaho Street. There's the location, Google pin. And you can see Panama City, Tyndall Air Force Base. Uh, Tallahassee is this way, Pensacola is this way, which you'll see on our Google Maps review. And again, you're just a hop, skip, and jump from the coast, Pensacola, Tallahassee, Dothan, Alabama. And here's your location. That's Compass Lake for those of you in the area. That's 231. And there's a, a number of other lakes and uh, waterways in the area. But let's go take a look if it will let me. We will go take a look at, here we go. So here's the property location right here off of Arapaho. It fronts right here. There's a home, there's a home, there's a home, there's a home. So not many neighbors here, perfect time to get into a property like this. We'll back out. You can see they've been subdivided, subdivided out here in nice little neighborhoods. Got the roadway system in here. There's Compass Lake, a couple little ponds, lakes, depending on how big they are for you. And you can see there's some other subdivisions that have roads and things cleared out as well in the area. 231. There you go. There's the property. Fountain to the south, Alford proper to the north, Apalachicola River. The infamous Route 10 to the north here. If you're going to go to Pensacola Way or back to Tallahassee. All right, you can see 231 is going to take you to the coast here. Down to Panama City Beach. We got Rosemary, Mexico Beach, Miramar, Destin. If you wanted to take a day trip and then retire to the peace and quiet of your country living lot there. Um, not a bad idea. And for those of you not in the area, we are in the panhandle of Florida here, okay? Tallahassee, right here, Pensacola. And you've got all of the coast. This is the Apalachicola area, a lot of uh, reserves and uh, nature preserves in that area. Uh, so definitely, definitely a good one here. So 
Um, I think I want to say Panama City is about it's about an hour or a little over an hour drive, I believe. So, uh, but at any rate, so we'll get you back on. So again, for this property that is which one? This one, right here. So for this property, we're asking 9,500, 94.9. It's in Jackson County, Alfred, Florida. It's 1.07 acres. And uh, these go quick. These go really quick. And we've had some folks upset. We apologize, but it's a first come, first serve. You sign the purchase agreement and pay for it. It's yours. Um, that's contractually binding to you. We need to fulfill that. So we apologize when other folks beat you to the punch. Um, they're just more savvy buyers. Uh, we try to help as much as we can and let you know, but sometimes folks think we're using it as a tactic or a strategy. Land goes on its own pretty much. Um, somebody usually wants land. It's just a matter of how, time, uh, how much time it takes. Okay. You don't, you, you don't have to push too hard on land. Um, so it, it's hard because folks get upset with us and they think we we're playing games that it wasn't really sold when it was. And they think we're using it as a tactic. So Get your information in order, get your own personal checklist on what you want out of the land and start going through that checklist as you identify three, four pieces of land. And then when you're ready to pull the trigger and you understand what you're looking for, you can be a little bit quicker on the punch because you have it dialed in on exactly what you want. Just a pro tip to buy in land. Um, but you, unfortunately, a lot of first time buyers do miss on land just because other people um, have experience or kind of know the drill or maybe have just done more homework as a first time buyer themselves. Um, so, again, apologizing in advance if you miss out on something because somebody else was able to pull the trigger. But we are operating a business and those who've committed, they lock the property contractually. That's it. That's all. Uh, of course, we contact folks if the contract falls through for some reason, uh, or they don't ultimately send the payment when they sign, of course, we'll contact you, but um, we're doing business on the up and up as others would expect us to, okay? Uh, nothing against anyone. All right. So again, this property, 9,500 bucks, Alford, Florida, that's Jackson County, 1.07 acres, nice little rural lot, but also would double as an investment lot as well. Uh, so you can buy with confidence. There's multiple exit strategies or multiple strategies to use the land uh, in however you like. Maybe you want a vacation property. Uh, maybe you just want a little getaway property out and away from things uh, from your home in the city. Perfect. So feel free to give us a call, but sign up and subscribe on the website, usrecland.com, and also subscribe to the YouTube channel and click the notification bell so that you're made aware of new video listings just like this one. Until then, happy land hunting.